moving on to the final story chili got embarrassed seriously embarrassed because she fell in love <laughs> we're speaking about none other than bill broda who of course is currently a radio presenter her name is actually jackie nyaminde now jackie tells a very interesting story about a few years ago she was hanging about and bumped into this one guy small guy kind of looked young and the guy was really interested in shooting his shot so he proceeded to shoot his shot tell her how he is a successful man from a successful family in fact his dad owns properties in vo i mean his grandfather owns properties in voi he has actual relationships with uh mr blue he's constantly hanging out with diamond and harmonize and he has quite a bit of money like he is balling balling now with broda slurped it all up she believed in this man she said oh yes and to add a little bit of spice to the mix apparently the man told her that he's actually tanzanian and she loves her tanzanian men in fact she loves tanzanians in general so she's like you know what this could be a thing and you got money too okay let's do this let's get this party started and it went on so far as he took her to a car yard where he showed her the car a big car worth eight million eight million shillings i don't know whether it's kenyan or Tan tanzanian eight million shillings and told her this car i've been eyeing this car i want to buy you this car you know what give me your car let me keep your car as we wait to get you this big big car this is what you deserve you cannot be driving around small small cars and she's like okay my man is gonna take care of me okay i love that for me now ultimately what happened is the man fell sick and when he fell sick he called will broda and said hey baby come check up on me i'm at a hospital xyz now she shows up to the hospital and it's apparently some small dingy clinic stroke hospital in pipeline and immediately she goes oh so you ain't got no dough you you do not have money it was just trying to get me into the box that's what was happening here you have no guap you were trying to take over my stuff you were trying to get me to give you my car and to get into my good graces so that you can like sort of get into my money and she was embarrassed she was absolutely mortified at the fact that she fell for this man and his lies and his you know perpetration of i am a rich man and ultimately she just dumped the guy and forgot about him but she says she has seriously been date, um, courted and wooed and has shoot the people shooting shots at her are young low boys and she says even when she was walking around with this particular young tanzanian man people would kind of look at her like okay so you're a mumama and this is your benton kind of looks but she was in love she didn't care now what is the lesson to be learned here the lesson to be learned here is when you fall in love with somebody, don't be running after their money. They could be lying to you. They could be telling you lies, just sting you so that you could fall into the trap. But ultimately, the truth always comes out. Please don't fall in love with someone because they told you they had money. Because guess what? Their money will always be their money unless they put their money into your bank account and it is under your name the properties the cars the whatevers ultimately they're still the rich person and you're still broke you're just hanging out with a rich person understand that let it get into your head and will broader i i beg i beg i pray that you find a rich old man because well a rich considerably aged man i don't know what your type is girl I, i'm not going to i'm not going to trust my prejudices and biases upon you 